Hello everybody! In this Python tutorial we're going to go over how to create a horizontal bar chart. We're going to move a little bit quicker through this tutorial than we have in some of our previous tutorials on how to create charts. So if you have additional questions or you'd like additional insights on how this code works, please feel free to check out those tutorials and you can find those in the Python playlist and then just check out some of the tutorials with charts in the title. Okay, because basically we've already gone over how all of this code works in general. We just wanted to go over a few additional details on how to create a horizontal bar chart as opposed to say a vertical bar chart or a stack bar chart. So a horizontal bar chart looks like this and all the code you see here will create this chart that you can see over here in the console. So the first thing you want to do is import your modules and packages and make sure you import matplotlib.pyplot and numpy. Then you want to go ahead and create your X and Y data and here we have the labels for the states and you can see those over here on the left part of the chart on the Y axis. And to create the locations for those labels you can create code that looks like this. And then you want to go ahead and create your numbers data. And in this case, we have population for the top five largest states in the US. And you can see the x axis down here on the bottom of the chart corresponds to those values. And this code will allow you to see your chart in a different order. So right now it goes from smallest to largest. But if you wanted to see it from largest to smallest, you could use this. And we'll show you that in just a second. To actually create your plot, you can use this code here, and you use plt.barh, and the H stands for horizontal. Then you want to go ahead and put in your Y coordinates, your data, and in this case we use population, and we've gone ahead and set the height to 0 0.8. Now you don't have to assign that to a variable, but we've gone ahead and assigned that to a variable so that down here we can assign the specific values for the population to each bar that you see here, such as the 12 million, 19 million, and 20 million. Then here we've gone ahead and created our labels. So we put in the X ticks labels, the Y ticks labels, the title, and the labels for the X and Y axis. If you'd like to put a grid on your chart, you can use plt.grid. And those are these gray grid lines that you see over top the chart. And as we mentioned, these values that you see here, 12 million, 19 million, 20 million, and so on, that correspond to the population numbers for each bar, if you'd like to do that, then you can use this type of code here. Okay, so we use a for loop, we loop through each bar, we create our width and our height, and then we use the plt.text to place those values. And inside the text, we've put four arguments, the x and the y, which tells the text where it needs to be placed, and then the s is the string, or the actual data values, and then we've gone ahead and put in a vertical alignment of center. And then finally, depending on the text editor or IDE that you're using to actually get the chart to show up, you may have to put in plt.show. So as you can see, if we run this, we get our chart over here in the console. And then if you would like to sort that from largest to smallest, you can use sort and then use states.reverse. Let's run this. And now you can see it's displayed from largest to smallest. Okay, so that's all we have for this tutorial on how to create a horizontal bar chart using Python and matplotlib and numpy. We will be doing many more Python tutorials in the near future. Join us for those and we'll see you next time.